Number 69. A pharmacy has amoxicillin 400 milligram per 5 milliliter suspension in stock. How many milliliters are needed to give a dose of 500 milligrams? A. 5 ml. B. 6.25 ml. C. 6.5 ml. Or D. 7 ml. And the answer is B. 6.25 ml. One way to solve this problem is to set up equivalent fractions, cross multiply, and then divide. So our suspension in stock is 400 milligrams per 5 milliliters, and we'll set that equal to 500 milligrams over X milliliters. 500 milligrams is the dose that we're wanting to know how many milliliters it would take. So if we cross multiply, 5 times 500 is 2500, and then divide by 400, that gives us 6.25 milliliters. So it would be 6.25 milliliters would be give a dose of 500 milligrams. And something to keep in mind when you're setting up the equivalent fractions, um, be sure that your top units match in the fractions and the bottom units match in the fractions. And that's the way it has to be for this to work. Thanks for watching. For more practice test questions, click below to see my full length PTCB Pharmacy Technician Certification Exam practice test that includes 90 questions with explained answers. And if you find this video useful, please like and share it with others who may find it helpful too. Subscribe to see more of my pharmacy learning videos. And if you'd like to support this channel with a donation, press the heart thanks button to give me a super thanks. Thanks, I really appreciate it.